There's the goal score we missed. Yeah. Hey, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Did you give us your head him all the way speech? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, he was all the way over to Benny. You got to respect him, right? So, I don't know. Just went in today. Didn't do anything different than it did the other games, except, you know, go up the floor a little quicker. Knee's feeling better, so that's always good. Right? Funny game to watch. A game, I know this is a game of runs, but you probably felt like you were overdoing it at times. Just the way you guys played so well in the first half and they came back and yeah, just kept inching closer and closer. It's a game of swings, though, right? We, we've all seen it happen. It's all about controlling those swings, and, and you know they're going to score goals. They're a good team, right? So. It's going to go in. They started shooting some shots on the outside. They, they started going, and, and uh, we just had to put an end to that with our transition and with a couple key goals, especially for, you know Mark's big goal there, put a, a stop to their runs, and then uh, we closed out. It seemed like those chances to transition came a lot easier tonight than, say, last week in Toronto. You didn't get chances Yeah, I don't know. It's uh, I found we had, a lot, we had a little bit more energy today. I don't, uh, couldn't tell you why. Maybe, you know, I think we were packing our defense a little more. We weren't so worried about you know, going out on, on shoot, shooting those guys. So it was, uh, I don't know, we found that energy. The ball was moving up the floor quick, and we were passing to our old guys, and it was in the back of the net, right? How about your game uh, changing over the years, right? Obviously, get the letter on the sweater today, and it doesn't seem that long ago we were talking to you for the first time, and uh, yeah. you were kind of looking up to guys here like Chris White and uh, those guys and Scott Self, and now you're kind of leading the charge with some young guys in the back and, yeah. and have a letter on the sweater. Yeah, I think it's nice, especially, you know, we have, we have some veteran leadership, right? But it's nice to have. I'm 26, right? Kind of in the middle of the five here, so I guess it's nice to have a guy in the middle with those with the letter on him. But it, it doesn't change my role on this team, right? It just, you know, might affect some some guys. But you know, I just try and play my game the way it is, and try not to uh, to let it, you know, overcome the way I'm playing the cross. So you know, the letter hasn't changed. Anything. You've got 20 more years, so you've got bar. <laughs> <laughs> when you have a half like that first half today, where everything's clicking and you're shredding the defense and playing good defense, shredding their defense playing so well. Is that almost like a huge building block to go forward from here that you can point to and say, okay, we're no we're capable of something like that for a good stretch? Yeah, it's nice to uh, it's nice to be able to know you can, you can score goals, right? But the biggest thing from that is that in changing, you can't let it, you can't let that become the game, right? It's 11-3 and then you saw what could happen, right? They're coming back. So I think that's going to be the biggest thing that we take from this game is that Listen, like they're going to score goals, and we're going to have to stop them. So you know, the lead's nice, and scoring goals is nice, but uh, you know, for me, it's stopping the goals and stopping the runs. Going up against Rochester tomorrow, do you see any? I don't know which film you may have watched on them so far, but how different are they? A different team than last year? They changed a few pieces, but yeah, they're uh, you know they're without Johnny Palace and, uh, and McCready on the right side, and they've added some pieces, but they're, they're a team that you always have to respect, right? They're very. Veteran, a lot of veteran leadership out the back door. You know, a great goalie in Vino, and uh, and you have to respect Jeremy in their offense, right? So it's going to be another one of those ones. Get some fluids in us, get a good night's sleep, and uh, go and put this game behind us and go and battle against Rochester. We also have some good games, so it'll be fun tomorrow. And play no bus, hotel, plane, <laughs> delays. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what a nightmare that was! Yeah. Yeah. Jeez. Okay. Thank you. All right. Thanks, guys.